Hey guys, what is up? It is me, the Harmless Shark here. And today I'm going to be teaching you how to get Unturned 3.0 and make an Unturned 3.0 server. Now, this might sound complicated, but it's not. First thing you want to do is go to your Steam, click, right click your Unturned, and this little scroll bar should pop up. Go all the way down to Properties, and then go to Betas. Yours should look exactly like this, except for this. What you want to type in here is Operation Maple Leaf. I know that's a mouthful, but no spaces, and it will be in the description. Once that has, it should say, successfully something code, I don't know, but the preview should be right here. So you want to select the preview close this and then it should automatically update and if it doesn't you can sorry I went a little faster there right click manage downloads this can be where you, whatever like let's say you have like tons of games downloading and you want one to be first there should be like a little up arrow and just click that and then it should automatically uh, update for first so so now you have preview in brackets and as you see launch it ta-da no. now for the server the server part is a little complicated um... go to bra um, properties again local files browse local files when this pops up you just need to go down to here and then find your unturned.exe create a shortcut for that and then rename it to whatever you want I'll just name mine server test now this should be it and then go down to pro <laughs> right click on that and go down to properties once this is here um if you do not already have a quote at the end of this, put a quote. Now what you want to do is space dash no graphics space dash batch mode. I apologize for that. That is a stupid beeping noise that is coming from my room for some reason. And then there are three server types. Secure insecure and LAN. 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 There we go. We want secure server. And oh, after batch mode, you want to put space plus, no space, secure server, then slash. Now this is the server that, or this is the folder that um, it will be saved to. So you want to name this the exact same thing you named your shortcut. Then you want to click apply. And why are you doing this? Okay, my computer is bugged. Um, but anyway, <sighs> um, if you don't already have the um, usually there will not be space here, but apparently my computer wants a space there. So double click this, and this comes up. You want to type in shutdown, and then you want to go into this folder, servers, and then you shall see server test, server, and then these are all your things you can do. Now you want to type in name, and then whatever, this is the right here, whatever you want the name to be. So I'm just going to name the server password and this right here is whatever you want your password to be. And then map. I would recommend dev test, but if you have your own map, type in what you named your own map. And then finally, um 
support. And not just 2544 for me. But this would be something else for you if you changed it. You want to save that and go back to server test or whatever you named it. And you should see successfully all this. And then if you launch unturned, play, connect. It works. Mine just apparently is not working for right now. Oh. Disabled pass. Oh, I know why. Um. Stupid. Um. I really hope you guys can't hear that, because that beeping noise, I'm gonna have to fix that. Uh, there is no password. Oh, this is probably why. I don't know what it is, but. Bye, P. Anyway, um. I forgot what my loop event was. But anyway. Uh, if you have any problems with this, let me know. Uh, once in a while, I know this happens to some people. It will say when you get in, server did not reply back. I'm not sure how to fix that yet, but if you do leave a comment, I can help you with that. Or at least I can try. But anyway guys, thank you so much for watching. Uh, leave a like, it helps me out. And yeah, I'll see you guys later. Bye.